Hello there, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with a stock swoosh, reviewing the market here. Huge call I made here in the market today. Huge call I made in Tesla today. Huge call I made in Apple today. I made a ton of huge calls last week. We're taking this energy into 2020, and it is huge. So, again, the QQQ's target was 220. We hit up on through it today, and let's take a look here. 338, not quite into the close here. Target for the SPY is 330, which we're not going to get to by the end of today. So the market looks higher. But again, called beautiful, beautiful options calls here in this market. You can't make a mistake when you get out when you're up. I mean, you can't lose when you get out when you're up. So, I mean, it's really up to people where they want to take profits. 50%, 100% hold. Again, the volatility is going to come in at some point. But right now, this was a great call today and we still look higher here and and i think part of it is a lot of people just the way that this set up was so good this morning in fact i'll tell you exactly what i thought of this morning when i got up and i saw this immediately when i saw the gap in the market today i said we're higher we're gonna make a new high today in fact i emailed uh fox news that was that was my talking point i said we're gonna make a new high today but anyways long story short i for a hot second i said to myself am i gonna call these today because it's kind of like, like I almost was like, I almost for like a hot second, I was like, am I really going to call this today? Because I, I, I really, really, last week was so good, was so, so strong. But then I said, no, I got to do what I do. I have to do what I do and I'm doing what I do. And I'm really good at what I do. So one of the traders in the room this morning said he's never, never seen anyone make calls like me, never seen anyone that has an intuition like me. And he's right. So, you know, when you have the information, which is the knowledge, like I have, you gain the skill over time, which I have, and then you, you also develop your intuition. And that's really how it is. Look at this. We're going to run up into the close. I wouldn't be surprised if we, I wouldn't be surprised at all if we gap up tomorrow morning. And remember the banks are tomorrow morning. The banks were tomorrow morning. The banks were Tuesday morning. Wednesday morning is Goldman Sachs. So this, this really, again, I'm looking at all of this stuff in anticipation for the move of the next 24 to 48 hours. However, that being said, remember that the Chinese delegation is coming to discuss tariffs this week. And we don't know the outcome of that. Everybody is so convinced that deal is going to get done in the next couple of days, the next week. I'm not convinced of that at all. So be careful. Again, you can't lose money when you book profits. Congratulations to everyone that did these trades today. Beautiful calls. If you'd like to learn my system, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. If you'd like a trial for the room, email me. If you would like uh, to sign up for the options newsletter, it's $59.99 a year. It's one year for six grand. You get all the options trades. I call the trades the strike, the date. You take the trade when you, when you, when you get the trade. And the ticker symbol, obviously. And uh, oh, here we go. This is a beautiful move here in this market. So, and people shorted this market. People shorted this market. I'm not saying that's why I went over the high today. I'm not saying that at all. I'm saying that people shorted this market, which was crazy, crazy, cray cray. Anyways, good luck, everyone. We'll see what this week brings. Earnings season starts tomorrow. A great time to trade. Momentum, volatility, gaps, we're looking for it all. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you have any questions or you want to sign up for one of my classes or the subscription services. Have a good day.